Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm here because I am in a Mother's Day swap and it's hosted by Geneva. She is purposely crafting the divine intervention and Denise, she is solo crafts there on YouTube. I will link these two fabulous ladies down below as well as my partner. Um, she is Robin and she is craft crafts. I heart here on YouTube and she is crafty heart. Um, M on um, Instagram. I will have everyone's information linked down below. And I do want to say that um, I'm wishing everyone a happy Mother's Day. Um, I use the Gingham Garden Collection for the projects. Uh, we did have a theme swap. So there was three themes on the swap that we could choose. And um, Robin and myself chose Tea Party uh, using the Gingham Garden. So it's I, I'm loving this collection. Um, I'm already using up the six by eight pad, but let me show you what I started. Now for this project here, we did have to make a uh, special item, which is an embellishment uh, book, box swap. So um, this was designed by DM. She is a cutesy shelf and, um, and Denise, she modified it and she made it into to a little box embellishment book. So it's so cute. Guys, go check out their videos. Um, I will link down everyone uh, down below. Also, um, we had to include uh, the embellishment, but I'm going to show you what I made for our swap. So I embellished this bag. It's from the Dollar Tree and... Um, I just put some uh, Emily's trim. She's Jersey Sea Girl E, and um, I put some dangles. This was gifted to me by uh, More Crafts um, Ashley, and um, I have some items here that I placed there. Uh, so inside here, oh, I also made this bow using uh, Luisa. She gifted us some vinyl scraps, so I made that bow there. Look how cute it looks! And inside here. I packaged up some goodies so they're packaged up so you kind of kind of can't really see what they are but I put some goodies and I did decorate I'm not gonna take them out because I do want it to be a surprise for her and um, later on she I will list down her channel so she could so you can see the unboxing so that's one item that I made for her so in this swap uh, we had to include a handmade cart two embellishments uh, a knick-knack mix um, which could have cabochons beads, a set of flowers, or chunky tassel, or ch chunky dangle, uh, and one crafter's choice. And then we have to purchase a ten to fifteen dollar item uh, for the for our swap partner. So, uh, so I I put a lot of goodies in this bag. And the next thing that I need is this package. Now I will sew it shut, but for right now I did want to show you what I made. I try to use uh, at least one of my stamps on this project because I want I have this little stamp here in my my stash and I wanted to use it because it's a little teapot and um, so I use it here and I put tea party because we went to with the tea party theme I use some of my friends um, Brenda's flowers look how cute it looks I use a doily and then I put vellum in there and inside here I made her this little box there. I think this was from KS Craft. It's used for chocolates, but I went ahead and I put some of these bowls there. This is a sample bowl that I made using Luisa's um, vinyl that she gifted me. So Luisa, I'm using your vinyl. Use your stash, guys. And um, I used some of the flowers and the teapots I had in my stash. And so I, I made some little embellishments uh, using these little teapots and I used Lori's flowers. And this was gifted to me by actually Denise in a swap. So I used it on here. It's so cute. Guys, let's use our embellishment. So I used the Gingham collection and it turned out so cute. I used in the back and it looks so cute. So I made that. And then inside here, there is a pokey tool. So I just box for her. I put these little tiny rosettes there. And let me show you the little pokey tool. Look how cute it came out. So it goes with that it goes with the gingham garden and it's so pretty so it just goes perfectly in this little box here and so and i will sew this when i'm ready to package it and mail it off 
so how cute is this turned out so pretty so that's one and then i also made her another one and there's another one of denise's little stamp embellishments that she uh gifted me in a swamp and i made another of these little teapots and put flowers on there <laughs> they look so adorable and then inside this little vellum, bo vellum bag is this little cute little butterfly which i use some dollar tree stickers and some of this um ribbon here which has butterflies i just put my information and i use some a dollar tree uh sticker there and so look how cute it says wonderful and then it has a little a little um die cut there so when you open this it's full of butterflies so they turned out so sweet look at this how adorable okay and then i also added these tiny tiny butterflies that i made uh which example is right there a little tiny butterfly so, so i included this butterfly little trinket box with butterflies inside and i'm gonna put it in this little vellum package and i'm gonna sew it together when I'm ready to package everything. So I also included uh, I also included, included a gift here, and it ha it has this little cluster here with a little butterfly and a little tea uh, teapot and a teacup right here. And it says spring and just added a little bowl there with a butterfly. And so this will be another little gift for her. I made some of these um, to decorate the packaging. Uh, I'm loving this stamp. I didn't color it because I don't know. I love how that black and white look so fancy. And I did add a little sticker in the background. So I used some of my dies and my stash um, to further embellish the packaging. And I loved how everything turned out. So guys, let me show you the main event, which is the embellishment book box. So let me clear everything off. I'll be back. So this is a little embellishment book that Denise um, altered. And uh, this design was first by DM, which is uh, her YouTube is cutesy shelf. So look at this cutie. Oh my gosh. Okay. This was a little challenging for me. <laughs> I guess because I had to follow directions, but overall it turned out cute. And I'm glad actually that, um, it doesn't look all that bad <laughs> so let me start off with the dangle and so we do need to include a chunky dangle so i included this one on the spine of this cute little embellishment book so you have um a tassel there some charms and it's just so cute and then on in the front here i added a shaker i added a shaker uh, element in the front too um with the chipboard and flowers and this embellishment here was gifted to me in a swamp and it was uh, gifted to me by Shiana and look at how beautiful and just perfect just the perfect amount of embellishment in the front and I added some chipboard from the collection here just to further um, bring it out and look how pretty it turned out and in the back it's a shaker right there this is so pretty I love this butterfly um, design on the paper and then we have these flowers here and i stitched with gold thread all around so let's open this baby up added seam binding right here for the closure and that's gonna go ahead she's a little chunky <laughs> but she turned out so pretty so yes i made my shaker pockets and um i used some of the uh it's the uh, cricket um acetate and it comes with this design so i use that gold design on there and i stitched all around the pocket to make it a shaker and look at those shaker bits it looks so pretty i added some stickers from the collection and i added some of the uh, plastic buttons the snap buttons so inside this pocket here we have the embellishments that are required for the swap let me take i didn't close it up because i wanted to show you so i made her this one and it it's a shaker so cute with a teacup and then another one there it says remember 
So you, I made those. And then here I added some of these um, sentiments. This is tea time and tea party. So she could have so she can have those for her stash. So that's a little first pocket there. So these go inside here. And then, and then on the right side here, uh, we're supposed to include a uh, handmade card. So I embellished this with the butterflies that I gifted her on in the package. And it says, I don't care where we go as long as we go together. So pretty and loving this collection. And then this is her card, which I made with a Coco Rosa die. It says mom and I included a note inside here. And it just, I had to make it small. So <laughs> this was perfect. The die was perfect, perfect size for this small little card that fits perfectly in this pocket right there. How cute. Then you further open it. And then in the middle, you find yourself with two boxes. And that's why it, this is called an embellishment uh, book box. <laughs> so um, I added some of the stickers on here how pretty it turned out so cute and look at that paper and loving that paper and so what I did is I added just a little tab on the side right here for the uh, acetate this one says love you and we're supposed to include a knickknack um, mix so I added some beads here some charms I'm not gonna take them out when she does her video you guys could see it in detail but I added some um, knickknacks there and also some cabochons and little items inside here now that i've showed you guys i could add a little bit of um washi tape here because it does bulge out a little bit so on this box here i added the flowers and most of these flowers are well all of these flowers are handmade and um these are made by my friend brenda and then some were made from others. This one's made by her. And I have these that were made by me. And then I have several made by, I think this one's made by Tay. So all these are handmade flowers. And it's just the perfect uh, colors for spring. And I'm loving how they look in this little box. So I did put uh, beautiful on this acetate and the stickers is just it's just so pretty i'm loving this collection i'm you're gonna hear it throughout this video okay so those are the two middle boxes and so the last one on here is this little pocket right here which is another shaker look how pretty i'm loving so i added some stickers and another little snap button and on this pocket here this is where i made these little cute teacups this is my uh, crafter's choice right here. I made her two um, types of embellishments. So I made her these little teacups that are too cute. I added um, a sentiment and then the little tiny flowers that just, just make look so sweet and cute. <laughs> so I added that one. And then I also made her some of these um, post-it stamps right there. Sorry about the glare. So I added some of these flowers I made. Look how cute they look. Okay, so I add, place everything back together. So you literally just one folds this way and then this way and it's a little chunky right here, but you could always tie it there. Let me go ahead and do that. She looks so cute guys, look at this. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. <laughs> so guys, um, please go and check out this hashtag. And the hashtag is MD Embellishment Book Box Swap. I am going to include the uh, hashtag on this video. And um, I hope you could join us in hopping onto the other channels to see what they made for this Mother's Day swap. I want to thank... Uh, Robin, which is my partner. I want to thank uh, Geneva and Denise for hosting this awesome swap. So guys, have an awesome day and I will talk to you soon. Bye.